the GLA250 suffers from a bit of an identity crisis it's not quite an SUV, not quite a performance hatchback. Heck, it's not even quite a Mercedes. The interior, although stylish and sophisticated in design, lacks the polish and refinement that we expect from the three-pointed star. Some of the materials seem cheap, and while the standard 7.0-inch infotainment screen functions are fairly intuitive, the cartoonish navigation graphics look out of place. Highway cruising is not up to usual Benz standards the firm suspension creates a choppy freeway ride and the wind ruffling past the side mirrors is intrusive. Other details live up to the GLA 250S premium intentions. A silver-colored panel, wood trim is optional, covers much of the dashboard and has subtle textured detailing. Satin finished metallic trim throughout the cabin looks classy and feels solid. The instrument panel features two large round analog gauges flanking a small digital screen. It's an upscale design. The gauges are rendered on a silver background and have large red needles, and the screen in the center of the dash functions as a high-res information center.